At the 2022 World Junior Championships, Letzile Tobogo just laid down a level of performance in the 100 meters that we've never seen before from a teenage athlete. Coming into this competition, he was the heavy favorite to defend his junior 100 meter title, which he won last year in a time of 10.19. This year, however, a sub 10 second performance was expected from him, given that he broke his own World Junior record just a couple of weeks ago when he ran a time of 994 at the World Championships in Oregon. In the heats, Tobogo ran a time of 10 seconds flat to break the championship record set by Adam Jamili back in 2012. Unsurprisingly, this was the fastest time among the heats, with the second fastest time coming from the Malaysian sprinter Azim Fami, who broke his country's senior national record with a very impressive time of 10.09. In the first semi-final, Tobogo cruised through along with the South African Benjamin Richardson, who won the silver medal last year. In the second semi, Puri Paul Boonsan of Thailand won with a time of 10.09, which is the fastest time ever run by an athlete under 18 years old, making it a world youth record and also Thailand's senior national record. What's even more incredible is that Boonsan is only 16 years old, meaning he will also have next season to improve on the world youth record. Boonsan is also third on the all-time list in the 200 meters at under 18 level, behind none other than Usain Bolt and Aria Knighton. With the 200 meters taking place at these championships in the next couple of days, he'll be one of the main contenders to win gold and may even be able to move ahead of Bolt's time in the process. In the third semi-final, Nkrumi of Jamaica finished first, with Fami finishing in second to take the automatic qualifying spots for the final. The lineup for the final consisted of some of the fastest athletes we've ever seen at this level, so there was an expectation for a fast race and it didn't disappoint. Tobogo took an early lead in the race and decided to begin showboating at approximately 70 meters to let his opponents know he had the race wrapped up. He finished with a time of 991, which no doubt would have been in the 98 if he ran all the way through the tape. In second place was Nkrumi, who finished with a time of 10.02, which broke the Jamaican under 20 record previously held by Johan Blake. In third place was Richardson, who finished with a time of 10.12, which was the same time displayed for Puri Paul, who finished in fourth. In fifth place was Fami, who also ran an impressive time of 10.14. This time would have been fast enough to win eight of the previous nine 100 meter finals at World Juniors, which just goes to show how incredible the level of talent has been this year. If these athletes continue with their rapid development, we could potentially see them dominate at senior level in years to come.